Hello, I'm Justin Bua, and this is American Revolutionaries. Great artists open our eyes, but very few, this many right here, change the way we see the world. Every Tuesday, Ovation takes a look at these groundbreaking creatives, from painters like myself to photographers, musicians, and designers. They've transcended their craft to become icons. He's one of the most colorful and controversial authors of all time. Truman Capote was known as much for his little voice as he was for his larger-than-life personality. Capote shot to fame in the late 50s with his novella Breakfast at Tiffany's and later reached literary superstardom with his groundbreaking true crime novel In Cold Blood. In later years, Capote became a media celebrity. Tonight, you hear Capote discuss, in his own words, his career. I was doing what I really amounted to a kind of sociological piece of research. Now, American Revolutionaries presents Truman Capote. Marlon Brando is an absolutely marvelous actor, but he's so dumb it makes your skin crawl. <laughs> Southern fags are really mean. <laughs> Norman Mailer described Capote as the best writer of my generation. He was drinking and taking drugs, and you can't make a person cure himself. He's got to go down to the bottom and then come up, and Truman just didn't come up. 